Yeah, I mean, no, like I said, the extra time guys were real high on him last year, and you know I tend to trust those guys when they tell me that Ryan Hong's head is the best left back in the league. I mean, how can I tell them no, right? Especially as we move into left backs, look at that transition. Yeah, yeah. Uh, especially when Claudio Bravo won our honor our uh, first annual DP Pod Outside Back of the Year award uh, last year. And is that a transition? It's the left back position. Yeah, it is. Nice. Whoosh. <laughs> so my top five George Bellow if he's here mm-hmm. if he's not here Ryan Hollings at Daniel Lovitz at four Dewan Jones at three Kai Wagner at two Claudio Bravo at one um, a lot of people and I'm already ready for it are going to tell me that Kai Wagner should be won by a mile I'm a numbers guy Claudio Bravo like worlds ahead <laughs> like it's not even close yeah um you know the uh the most crosses blocked he had one and a half tackles more per game you know every every two games he was making three more tackles um the only thing kai wagner did was really good going forward and claudio bravo can improve that for sure but um for the most part he was right around where all the other people were kai wagner was just kind of crazy um Daniel Lovett's got to look, got to show some love for my Nashville boys. Um, 1.4 crosses completed, 63% tackle success rate. Dewan Jones, we love a good fourth round draft pick. Um, winning supporter shield, 75% tackle success rate, uh, about a cross per game. Um, if George Bellows here, he was okay. Obviously can get much better, but if he wants to go, I will put Ryan Hollingshead on there simply for Adam. Uh, I will say off the bat that I think you have uh, done your boy Andrew Gutman pretty dirty there. I mean, he was very good for you guys last season. I don't know if he's going to play. If Bellow's gone, he is. If it's a big, it's not done yet. There's a whole bunch of stuff in there. There's I know, but you're gone. but you're saying you're saying if Bellow's gone, you're going to put Ryan Hollingshead ahead of Gutman here on. To replace Bellow on the list? Yep, because I don't know if Gutman fits into that system well. Doesn't matter. It's yeah, such a Red Bull monster. Who cares about the system? Oh my God, he, he's a Red Bull. <laughs> he's a Red Bull. He knows. All right. Knows. Anyway, um, my list isn't a ton different. I, I have Chase Gasper at five. I have George Bellow at four. Dwan Jones at three. Kai Wagner at two, and then Claudio Bravo at one. Oh, you did Daniel Love. It's so dirty. He's in my honorable mentions. I know but... he is, and Gasper's in mine. But I think I'll take Lovitz over Gasper any day of the week. And I, when Lovitz was in Montreal, like bottom, did not like him at all. Move him over into Nashville, and he's thriving. So that tells you how much. That's fair. I can I can be on board with switching him, uh, but okay. we're gonna do I'll... we're gonna do Twitter posts with our you know, top, our top fives or top tens. So keep an eye out for those and uh, we'll work on, you know, you, you can tell us how it goes in the comments or whatever, but I'm glad we're relatively close on. 